the 4-3 victory over St. Louis last night in Toronto, Leaf captain Rick Vibe became the first player in Toronto history to score 50 goals in a single season. Vibe to Benny, and Leut was there. Gerlego working from the point. What is he going to do with it? He's weaving his way in. Over the back. He scores! Number 50! What a play by Gerlego, and Vibe was there to finish it off, and he's going to get the standing ovation. Goal number 50. They get him the puck. What a setup. What a setup by Billy Gerlego. Just beautiful. Oh, it's actually it's just it's a big relief is what it is. Uh, uh, when I scored that one tonight, a big piano fell off my back that I've been carrying around for a while. But uh, it's it's a great thrill, and uh, I'm just glad it's over with. Rick Vive turned out to be a great leader for Toronto. The, Blue Jay, the Blues came back in the third period to make a 3-2. Freacher slammed home. A Rick Vive passed to give the Leafs a 4-3 win. And Toronto trails the Blues by nine now. To make the playoffs, the Leafs must win their remaining five, and the Blues, in turn, must lose their remaining five. We've got goal 50. Miroslav Freacher got the winner. The Leafs downing the Blues 4-3. Bob McCowan has highlights. Pick up the action. Scores tied 1-1 in the first period. And here is Vive's... 50 of the year. Billy DeLego will move in. Nice move there and set him up at the corner. Bang. Vibes got it. 50 on the year. That makes it 2-1 Leafs. No scoring in the second. Brian Sutter had tied it for the Blues in the third. Jorgen Pedersen then puts St. Louis ahead on this breakaway. 3-2 St. Louis. Leafs fight back to tie it after Mike Leute blocks Stu Gavin's long shot. Jim Benning will feed Walt Podubny and he'll beat Leute to tie it at 3-3 right there. After four goal outburst that carried the Leafs to an 8-5 victory over Chicago. Bob Murray off the board, stolen by Derlego. Derlego a pass to five, five shoots, he scores! Into the empty net to break Frank Mahomes' record. Literally, you know, I, I, well, I knew I could do it. It was, you know, I only needed three or four and still had seven or eight games left. But uh, back a couple of months, I would have said, no, I, was, I don't think so. What's it mean to you to break Frank Mahomes' club record? Well, it's... It's a big thing, I, you know. Uh, I, you know, I'm quite thrilled and uh, happy about it. Uh, it's uh, something that hasn't been done for quite a while, and like I say, I'm quite pleased. But uh, uh, you know, it, w it would be a lot better under different circumstances. Uh, you know, if the hockey club was, uh, you know, securely in the playoffs or something like that. But uh, it, it's still a big thrill.